I'm here to talk to you today about a problem that has come to our attention and come to the attention of authorities. And that is a scheme that involves investors buying life insurance policies that are in fact betting on your death in order to get profits. And that is known as the life settlements or the stranger owned life insurance policy. And that was the subject of an NASD investor alert that was recently issued entitled Seniors Beware. This new concern of the NASD surrounds the targeting of seniors, usually 65 years or older, and convinces them to sell their existing life insurance. And the way the scheme works is the 65 year or older individual who has an existing life insurance policy, sells that policy to a stranger or to a third party. In return, the individual, the victim, receives cash and the investor receives your insurance policy. The investor will pay the premiums and wait until you die until they collect their profits. There's a twist on this, and that is sometimes the insurance settlement brokers or insurance agents will convince individuals, usually at a seminar or a luncheon, that they should buy a new policy, and if they can't afford the policy, they will actually arrange for premiums to be financed by a third party. And again, they wait until you die, until they receive their money, and you receive some small or cash payment in that case. This is appropriate in less than 1% of the existing policyholders. So if you've already sold your policy, then it is most likely that you have been a victim of the scheme that has been the subject of this alert by the NASD. And what's wrong with this? There's a lot of things wrong with it. One is usually there's a tax consequence that is not disclosed to you. Two, there are some privacy issues in that your medical information is going to be shared with strangers. And those strangers, if they sell your policy to a third party or to a fourth party, will pass your medical information along to those individuals. But the real problem with this is that when you have sold your life insurance policy, it's the distinct possibility that you did not receive the fair value for that policy because the sale of that policy is completely unregulated and is done by auction or bid and there's been some serious problems where fraud has been committed in the sale of those policies. Here's what you need to do. If you've already sold your policy and don't think you got what you should have or you're having second thoughts about it, you need to contact a lawyer. Now, if you want more information on life settlements or stranger-owned policies or this scheme, please look further on our website. We have the NASD uh, investor alert, and we also have other articles and studies that further discuss this problem.